Hello my beauties and welcome to yet another episode of Skincare with Asikia Iyala. Of course, I'm your girl Asikia Iyala. Today I am back with another exciting video. And this topic is requested from one of you guys. I think this person saw a previous video that I made about supplements. And um, the person requested that I, I should make a super green uh, powder that you can actually and um i've got all my greens here and i'll be walking you guys through on all of these greens that i have here and this is what we call super greens so over here i have the kale which is very very nutritious very beneficial to the body and um, i have here my uh spinach this is a baby spinach but please guys let me say this if you want to have a full benefit of this supplements that I'll be making today, you want to go for the organic. Please, guys, go for the organic. With that, you'll be able to gain more, okay? So this is spinach, and you guys know spinach is packed with so, so much nutrients in them. I will be making all the list on my screen because I don't want to take too much time. So you can look at my screen and see the benefits you can get. I'm just going to list five each of each of the greens that I have here. Now over here, I have my celery. Yeah, also organic. You want to make sure it is organic as well. Um, here I have the beetroot leaf. I know you guys, you know this. If you don't, please do a research and check what this can do for the body because it's very very healthy and very nutritious to the body okay and then over here i have the celery celery also is very good for the body it has so many benefits as well now what i need to do is to wash this properly and then try to get as much liquid on it as possible before i start to dehydrate because the whole um, brain behind this um, process is to dehydrate the um, leaves, bring them to a very good dry uh, state before we can now blend and continue from there. Some people might ask, because in my previous video, I had so many questions like, should I dry it outside or should I use a microwave? If you can dry them outside to air dry, that will be a very good solution as well, but it is not gonna be too healthy when it comes to dust and all of that stuff. That is something that I will be concerned about, yeah? But that will be one of the best way to actually dry your leaves. So if you can dry them in a very good, healthy environment, that will be superb. Now, when it comes to microwave, no, 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 no. Do not use your microwave for this. That's not gonna work, please, no okay because you're gonna get more moisture it's gonna boil in fact it's gonna, <laughs> it's no that's a no-no okay so you either have the dehydrator i'll be showing you guys the, de the, the dehydrator that i have is a very small one i'll be leaving a link to where you can buy the molder because we have the molder for the capsules and then we have the what else am i using we have the dehydrator I'll be putting the link on Amazon where you can buy that if you're interested in. Um, so I'll quickly wash this. I have my sink over there. I want to wash this and make sure that they are properly clean before you proceed. I am back and um, I just want to point out this really quick now this is my celery and it is very chunky and for me to be able to have this dehydrated very quickly is to slice them just like an inch this way okay guys an inch so they can all dehydrate really fast
it took me forever to get my vegetables properly cleaned and um, this is my dehydrator and I'm using a very small dehydrator because this is what I have I have to remove this first so I can show you guys how it can be done or oh, let me do it this way now I hope you guys can see what I'm doing okay yeah you guys can see that now what I need to do is to just lie this down flat still have some liquid or better still I should put this in here so I don't I just hope you guys are seeing that's the most important thing right now <laughs> okay okay good so I'm just gonna lay this in here like so there's still some good amount of water but that's okay Now I'm going to go in with the second step. my dehydrated vegetables and this took a while I had to fill up this container it's just one of those months that I have to get them out of the way because I use them in soap making I make supplements out of it and um, yeah I had to make a lot so the next step to take is to blend them right here is my powder which is my super greens and um, you all know what I have here already so I don't need to go through that I've got my capsules and I have my filler which is the molder so what I'm gonna do is to show you guys um, how you can actually fill this in on your own at home now this is very easy to find I'll be leaving a link on Amazon where you can actually buy the molder okay now the first thing we want to do we want to take the bottom already I have differentiated the bottom yeah this is the bottom and this is the top okay we want to go in first with the bottom which is the longer side and over here we have to put this one first okay like so and then we want to Spread this in here so they can sit. sitting properly and okay <laughs> so you can see 
all of the capsules are in there but we have one two and three that are upside down and then we have some here you can manually just fill them in like so I can't find glove to buy why am I using this big ass glove <laughs> I'm not liking it on this though, but I have to use, okay, there's one more here. Oh, that's also upside down. All right, so what we need to do is to get this ones out. This ones that are not properly seated, they are upside down. So you wanna push down a little bit and then pull them so you can be able to remove the ones that are sitting upside down. Okay, guys. All right. So we want to fill them back in properly. One, two, three, and four. One more. Five. Okay. Good. This is excellent. All right. Now that we have the capsule, which is the bottom in here, what we want to do is to fill this up. Okay, guys. And let's do this. Where's my spoon? I hope you guys can see what I'm doing. Okay. So we want to fill in the bottom. Like so. careful so you don't waste any of it capsules are very expensive nowadays and it's always best to make yours at home knowing what you're actually putting into your capsules and um, it's cheaper this way trust me <laughs> don't call me cheap please <laughs> I just want to be healthy I want to know what I'm taking in putting into my body it's very important guys there's just so much so much so much stuff going on in the world right now and for you to be safe you just have to find the time to do stuff like this, you know. This is a very powerful supplement. Very powerful supplement, guys. Trust me. Okay. So you want to get your you want to get this packed i don't know what it is called is it a presser i, I don't know <laughs> you want to get this part and then just push in you want to do this to be 100 percent sure that it is well properly filled up Let's 
still have my dehydrator running. I still have some vegetables in there. So I make a lot of supplements like beetroot, ginger, um, what's this name? Uh, what is it called? Turmeric. Um, where's my head? Is again? <laughs> Moringa, yeah, matcha, all of that good stuff. Spirulina, oh yeah. So those are very good super grains. You can actually make those. Okay. Just, just move this aside. The next step is to get the head, and then we have to position this like so on top of it make sure it is properly set pour in your capsule and then shake it on floor Yeah, I know this is too much work, but it, it's what <laughs> it's what's making your own capsule at home, knowing 100% that what you're taking, putting into your body, it's pure. For me, it's just the best. I can't trade that for anything. So just find the time to do this on your own at home. You can practically make any kind of supplement you want any kind of supplement all right now that i'm done with this i think yeah yeah everything is set well and then we want to get the head this way okay i want to make sure now this is a sign this is how you know you're actually um, putting it in the right position it has to be this way there's a sign here written it has to be this way guys so once you're done you turn it around this way and then okay you see everything is set And then you want to push hard downwards okay guys like so now you will hear like a locking sound okay and then you know the capsules are coming together all right once you're done we have our capsule here voila let me get a plate. One minute. Okay. Now this is ready. I should be using something bigger. I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm so tired. I've been working since morning. You can imagine. Today is Monday. And I started shooting this video yesterday. I said to myself, I have to finish. No matter how tired I get today, I have to get this out of the way. Because the best way is when you dehydrate, you want to blend immediately. So, yeah. All right, I'm just gonna make this for you guys to see. Yeah, these are my supplements. Very easy, 
I know it takes a little bit of time. You don't even have much to do. The reason why it's this, this process is just so long for me is because I'm shooting a video. Um, on a normal day, once my vegetables are properly cleaned, washed, I will just put them in the dehydrator, leave them there overnight. The next day morning, blend and voila, I'm done. Just the, the capsule doesn't take time, you know? If you guys want to see me make a video on how to make handmade soap with my beautiful vegetable leaves, then leave your comment in my comment section. So if I have like two or five people asking me to make handmade soap with this, then I'm going to make that video. Okay, guys. So uh, what else do I want to say before I leave? I just want to encourage anyone who is watching this video that you can actually do something for yourself that you would feel proud about. Yes, it's not just making money out of something. You can be proud to have a very good healthy lifestyle. To me, this I cannot trade with going online to buy supplements. Yes, I still buy some supplements online that I cannot make on my own or if I cannot access those vegetables or roots or whatever, then I want to buy from other manufacturer. But in a case like this, where I can produce this by myself, knowing that everything used is organic. Mind you, the capsule itself is made from rice. This is not just an ordinary capsule. So everything here is vegan. Everything here is pure no toxic nothing my environment is very clean <laughs> trust me i picked hand washed each and every vegetable that i used properly well with my vinegar if you have any question please do not hesitate to leave your question in my comment section and i'll be willing to reply back to you as soon as i can i need to clean up this place you can follow me on facebook you can follow me on instagram but i would prefer you follow me on instagram yes you can dm me with any private message you have and please also consider the fact that i am a very busy person don't get mad at me if i don't reply to your message on time yes uh, what else do I want to say? Like I will always say, if it doesn't feed you, do not water it. Bye for now, guys, and stay blessed. I love you.